celebrate World Outlander Day with the 21 best episodes, including author Diana Gabaldon's favorites. With Outlander Season 5 behind us and Droughtlander and World Outlander Day upon us, now is the perfect time to re-watch the best episodes from the entire series so far. But how to choose which are the best of the best? We went straight to the source, Outlander book author Diana Gabaldon, who graciously gave us her personal selections. We also added in some can't-miss fan favorites. Our rankings go by season, as many fans would agree that season 1 was the series' strongest, although this season had some powerful episodes including one Gabaldon wrote herself, so you know it's good. Keep reading for Diana Gabaldon's favorite Outlander episodes, plus a few more from fans, unless otherwise noted, the picks are hers. Caution, light spoilers ahead. Outlander Season 1 Episode 1, Sassanak The first Outlander episode ever introduced viewers to the mystical setting of Scotland and the characters we'd come to love. Even though Claire, Katrina Bailf, and Jamie, Sam Hugan, hadn't yet begun their romance, how can fans, and Gabaldon herself, not be transported by Claire's journey through the stones at Craynaudon and back in time to the 18th century? The episode is filled with so many iconic moments, Claire watching the Druid Aquiman dancing among the stones, her first meeting with the evil Black Jack Randall, Tobias Menzies, healing Jamie's wounds and their horseback ride to Castle Leoke, the ruins of which 1940s Claire had just been exploring with her husband, Frank, also Menzies. And let's not forget Frank's strange encounter with a Highlander in all his Scottish glory who, Gabaldon confirmed, is Jamie's ghost. Outlander Season 1 Episode 2, Castle Leoke It's sinking in for Claire that she really has traveled to the past as she, and viewers, get their first real glimpse of the world she's entered into, which makes this one of Gabaldon's favorite episodes. Castle Leoke is the home of the Mackenzie clan, and Claire's not quite sure what to make of them. They're not sure what to make of her, either. Claire and Jamie have their first heart-to-heart as he reveals how he got the scars on his back and she tells him that her husband is not alive, totally true, we also enjoy the first of many feasts in the castle's great hall. Clara's talents as a healer come in handy, but that also means Jamie's uncles, Castle Laird Column and his brother, Dougal, want to keep her there, but as a guest, or a prisoner. Outlander Season 1 Episode 7, The Wedding This one is on Gabaldon's list and most fans would include it on theirs, too. After all, it's Claire and Jamie's wedding, when they recite their now famous wedding vows, blood of my blood, and bones of my bone. Even though initially they only agree to marry to keep Claire safe from Black Jack Randall, on their wedding night the newlyweds can't deny their mutual attraction. Viewers waited six and a half long episodes for the couple to consummate their love as we see them progress from the awkwardness of their first time to their thorough enjoyment of each other. Outlander Season 1 Episode 15, Wentworth Prison The setup to the first season finale finds Jamie saved from execution by Black Jack Randall, who wants him for his own nefarious purposes, and throws him in the prison dungeon. Claire, meanwhile, is busy hatching a plan to break Jamie out, unfortunately, she too is caught by Black Jack after just a few fleeting moments alone with Jamie in his cell. Jamie makes a bargain, he won't fight against Jack in return for Clara's release. And in one of the most poignant moments of the season, before Black Jack lets her go, Claire tells him she is a witch and whispers in his ear the exact date of his death, which she knows because, time travel. Outlander Season 1 Episode 16, To Ransom a Man's Soul this is not an easy episode to watch, but it's so outstandingly done that it must make it onto anyone's, including Gabaldon's, best list. Having promised not to fight Black Jack, Jamie succumbs to the torture of his captor. Hogan and Menzies give unforgettable, heart-trenching performances. The episode offers a bit of levity in Mertig's successful plan to use a herd of cattle to literally break down the back door of the prison. After Jamie recovers, he and Claire sail away to France, and Claire reveals she is pregnant. Mm -hmm.